Hello everyone, this is Kim Mason, the proud principal of the Rosenwald Eagles, and I'd like to share with you what we envision as a plan to implement STEAM at Rosenwald. At Rosenwald Elementary Middle School, we're embarking on a school-wide STEAM journey. We're so excited to have some grounding and direction through our Project Lead the Way grants for the elementary and for the middle school students. Our community partners will enhance the units that we've decided to implement. For example, we have local medical facilities and universities, which include doctors, nurses, technicians, uh, professors, engineers, etc. Uh, we have several hospitals within just a few miles of our school, and these experts will be invited to participate in helping us implement a world-class STEAM program right here at Rosenwald. How will they help? Well, we expect that they will be able to help us by participating in lessons, uh, helping to judge student presentations, uh, sometimes co-teaching lessons in our biomedical units or in our computer science units or maybe even in our animal life and animation units. Other areas include the diversity of life and animation where we will call on our 4-H leaders, uh, Clemson Extension supporters, and even our mayor who owns a farm to complete the lessons animation we will look to local engineers and use their expertise in the areas of app building animation and maybe even some robotics at rosenwald the bulk of our lessons will take place in the steam lab but they will also be supported in our classrooms with science instruction. Some of our core teachers have already agreed to be a part of our STEAM leaders to help develop lessons and keep everybody energized and accountable in this conceptual model. The community itself will truly be invaluable because they bring a level of expertise in computer science, in engineering, in biology or medicine, or even forensics that most of our teachers would not have or possess. So hopefully their guidance and support will make a lasting real world impact on our students.